there, M here. Welcome back to Let's Play Off. Last time, Daydon got stomped. After he stomped me. But point is, he's now dead, so now we can move on to the next zone. Which I believe is right here. Nope, that's zone zero. Here is zone two. Let's enter it together. Oh god, it's pink! Okay, it's more of a hot pink, but... Still. Hot pink's not as bad as regular pink. I'll give it that. Aw, listen to how safe, safe it all sounds. How nice and calm and all that stuff. You are now in zone two. Enjoy your stay. Now, if memory serves me right, this track is called Desperately Safe, and you'll soon see why. Okay, center is has the library, so let's let's pay a visit to the library. Yes, you shouldn't lend any more books to that man. He tears out the pages. It's almost dangerous. Okay, uh, I'll say that you shouldn't lend books to anyone who decides to frickin' wreck, like, tear pages out of them, but it's not dangerous. Yes, I'm going back upstairs. Uh, hello, good sir. Hello, welcome to the library. Uh, I should point out that the upper floors are inaccessible because of the specters. There are specters in this building? Uh, y yes. Why do you ask? I will eliminate them. No, we will eliminate them better, remember? I'm supposed to be the gut person controlling your every move. El eliminate the specters? But, uh, uh, you know, y uh, you, you could get hurt, and, uh, there's nothing for you up there. Just walls, shelves, stairs, and an old cat. A cat? I'll go up and purify the upper floors. Ah, uh, um, good. Okay, don't be too loud then. And the fourth floor is not really accessible. People have torn pages out of the books, so I don't want to go up there. It could be dangerous. Dangerous because people tore, out pa tore pages out of books. Look, fatalism is not cool and all, but... I'm doing nothing wrong. I'm just looking at the wall. But... That doesn't mean it's not safe to go there. This... this is a large building. These shelves are fake. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that part. There's fake shelves and... not much else. It's not easy to find your way out of here. Everything looks the same. Right, that just leads me back to the back door. Is anyone down here? Shelves are still fake. Stop having me check to see if they're fake. Hello. I... I prefer the fake books. You don't need to worry about damaging them. This book is titled Explanations. Read. Index. Introduction. The creation of the modern world. The guardians. The queen and her son. The four zones. Zone zero. The toad king and the merchant. Annex. Glossary. Author's note. I will write these down and one of these days you'll understand why. I can't say for sure why because that's a spoiler, but... There's a reason. This book is entitled Written by E.S. Read. Prenez garde, madame. Vous commence, commencez au grossier. Et grossier se vie lier. En suivant la méthode de Croz, qui a introduit les portes dans les sophig, vous conserverez toutes votre sveltes. Trois sonates de... Word determine un am gai um, um, progressive tree sensible et six fugus de on sur le cédule a dépressé une action foudroyante. On peut, en, on peut encore accélérer le effet du traitement en l'exécutant ex sur. That was my attempt at reading French. I probably made some people mad. Cause I have never taken a French course. I've taken Spanish and I've taken German, but I haven't, I've never taken French. Thought about it, but then I decided, nah, I'll take a German class. You wanna know how that ended? With me as the only person in that class cause it was a night class and everybody else dropped out. Moving on. Up, uh, it's up. Uh, it is not required to keep track of one's direction in the pink fortress. Painted on the walls are arrows pointing towards the right directions. On this page are 
printed the four symbols and as well as the four card and ow. It seems that no matter how much I try, the book stays upside down. Someone that's a witch! I have run out of oxygen. That's creepy. Bismarck, for she chose three guardians to rule some of the zones. The Firebird was chosen as the Lord of the Second Zone, the Eternal City of Bismarck. They were the... Uh, well, now we have a neighbor zone, too. Bismarck. Up the chil up children down. And so... Swirling in the belly of the world, 700,000 children of the... Unnawed of the... Something. Nod at... Of the sin? Is that what it says? Of the sin? Nod at the justice put in place by the queen during her peaceful reign. They are the physical manifestations of evil. Deeds? Evil deeds? Released upon the world. Forever lost in their seething madness. They are unsalvageable and immortal. Only the queen herself... At the time of the final confrontation, we'll have the power to annihilate the tainted power of the of the worm child? Chapter two of the of Apocalypse in Black Liches. Lick Lickies Liches. All of the souls on exile for their sins will be tortured for eternity by the Legion of the Black Liches. What's this? Unreadable. Oh, it's a Thing of flowers. Tales and legends. The Toad King. A long time ago lived an evil king. His face was so repulsive that he was nicknamed the Toad King. One day, a masked man met the king during an audience. He said the following words to him. Greetings, wretched monarch. Leave this land at once or perish at the tip of my blade. The king replied, I am the king and you are my subjects. You are not to go against my will. And so the masked king slew the king with his mighty sword. The end. Did I talk to you? Don't turn the pages. It makes too much noise. Oh, okay. Guess that's why I didn't read the rest of the of the books. Well, what about? Oh, I remember this one. Okay, so this is another puzzle. There's a page on, of a book on the wall. Now what's this? It's a club. Okay, that's a spade. So this is gonna take a bit. Fun fact, these books actually tell a bit of a story, if you can read it, because a lot of the te text is faded. Oh, hello. Upside down specters, oh no! Oh, they're actually called uh, upside down specters. Inverted ectoplasmic incarnation. Heavy silence, you want me to enjoy the silence or something? Good song, by the way. Okay, now what's... No. Crap. More upside down specters. I took one step and I got attacked by more of these things. It's as if they heard their brothers or sisters or whatever call for them. They're like, we must avenge them. Well, your vengeance is gonna be, uh, cut short a bit. Because you had to go ahead and attack the batter. Okay, this is a two of clubs, so we need to go back down and get the three of clubs. This is actually one of my favorite puzzles from the game. Oh, nope. I'm supposed to take the page. No! No more! No more inverted specters! I'm trying to put these books back together! These books need to be fixed, they shouldn't be left torn apart and all that stuff! Alright, now let's put this page back where it belongs. This is the story of three guardians chosen by the queen to rule over the zones, islets of lo life lost in the netherworld. The first guardian, Daedon, was filled with anger. Thanks to his strong determination and his body made out of steel, he ruled his zone with an iron fist. If his body was made out of steel, I'm pretty sure he would have survived against the batter. Or at the very least, he would have kicked his ass. Well, he did technically, but... What's this page? A five of diamonds. So that book is fine. I need to find a book with a four of diamonds. So this is it. No, that's a seven of hearts. Okay, five of diamonds, I'll take this pit book, this one, and go see if I can find the book that needs to be made whole. Hopefully I don't run into too many more inverted specters. Okay, four of diamonds, so this is where it needs to go. Can I read the second part? The second one was good and generous. 
to his kind, good and generous, to his kind personality, he was loved by all. He was constantly at his best to, doing his best to provide safety and peace to his subjects. Okay, so that one talks about the second guardian. God damn it! Let me fix these books in peace, Spectres! Converted chain has been acquired. That might be, that might be stronger than saturated chain. What's that about? Converted chain, yeah, that's stronger than saturated chain. Costs quite a bit more CP, though. Okay, what's this? This is a queen. So I'll take that. I checked there, so I'm guessing the queen page must be for the book over here, because I don't think I've seen this one. That's a- yeah, I think this is supposed to go here. Yeah, that- it's impossible to read the paragraph on that one. Now there's one more page missing. Where is that- oh, there's a chest there. What's here? A joker! Well, good for me, but I can't use it. We're trying to silence me. I understand that you look kind of weird floating upside down like that, but I'm not impressed. You can't mute me. Now, I always forget what you're supposed to do for the final page, but I think you need to go this way. Oh, no, not quite. I think I need to go down here. But first, let's talk to these two. We can't get to the park. Maybe it's better that way. There has to be a good reason. I have no fear. I know how to stop being scared. I am not afraid. Do you want to know how? Come a little closer and I'll tell you. Are you gonna get all stressed out and go burnt on me? If you're not afraid. This page has enlightened me. I'm not afraid now. Do you want to be free from fear? Give me a hundred credits and I'll give you the page. All right, here. Here, I'll give you the page. I don't mind, I have a lot of money. Well, on a side note, I think we all know who the Vandal is. All right, so that means the missing page should be the Eight of Hearts. Okay, so I noticed that these that these books each have a paragraph that's more read that's like more readable. Like this one, you can kind of see the third one better. Another one, you can see the last one better, but it's still blurry enough to that so that like you can't quite read it all unless you really took the time to go into it and you know fixed any mis mistakes or whatever. I put the pages back into their books. I had to do your job for you. Ah, uh, ha! That's that's very good. I'll I'll let you up then. That's that's great. The fourth floor is now accessible for you and you only. The way I put it sounds ominous. But whatever, let's go up to the fourth floor. Up a safe block. That can't be good. Alright, here we are. Hey, it's a cat! Who... Who are you? What is that in your hand? You're not the judge. The... The judge? No. No, I am not. My name is Chaffet. I am the creator of this city. I am also the one leading the phantoms, the royal instruments of my vengeance. You are the chief of the specters. Specifically, they are my arms, sent to me by the queen to restore justice to this zone. You must have been very determined to have set foot onto the stairs of this library. I recognize in you a certain courage, an exceptional trait for a fear-riddled place such as this. Nah, I'm just curious. However, my revenge will not leave anyone unpunished. Thus, you shall be the first to succumb to the blasts of my ectoplasmic army! Oh dear, we got a cat commanding the specters. I do not need any specters to eliminate you, you poor sport pajama wearing clown! I will finally get the taste of justice! <laughs> I keep hurting my voice with this stuff. Let's see how Converter Chain does. Not bad. Hey, you might need those specters after all, Jaffet. Come on. Your spirit is a valiant one, and your arms are made in its image. 
I must confess that I may have underestimated you. Unfortunately for you, I would discall all manners as a gentleman when necessary. Especially for a new enemy. Spectres, come to me, dance together, and echo the song of the righteous! The torment of men heals my wounds. Your body will feed the intangible spirits for eternity. Where are they, huh? Phantoms! Phantoms! Come to me! I command you! Curses! By what magic, baleful human, do you manage to prevent my ectoplasmic acolytes from joining me? No matter, you will taste my wrath! Oh, whoa! That did a lot of damage, man. But I did too much to you. Oh no, it's Apollyon's meat. <sighs> Poor fool! It is not yet time for me to reveal my true nature. Still, know that you will gain nothing by waiting, obnoxious buffoon! Hello, I see another add-on. Who are you? Add-on Omega! Oh, this place is locked. This barrier prevents me from going upstairs. It's impossible to climb any higher at this point. Now, let's take a look at Omega. Oh good, Omega's the same level as everyone else. Would've sucked otherwise. Inverse Perspective cures blindness and muteness. Overdone Perspective cures poison and sleep. And Optimized Blur. Hmm. So, like... Alpha's more of an attacker, while Omega seems to be more of a healer. Neat. Wonder how often I'll need Omega's abilities in this one. Hey you, you got a bit of a stray cat upstairs going around calling himself Joffet. Ugh. Are you alright? You didn't get hurt up there? Well, at any rate, I saw a cat. I expect it to be by the south entrance. I suppose I need to go back down. Because it's south, I should have known better. Hey, it's the judge! Greetings, dear immaculate comrade. Has your journey not taken you to a place of optimum conditions? This is a drier area compared to previous surroundings. I must admit that I, for one, am delighted. The feline gent is not very fond of rain. I have heard from an old friend that the shopping mall in the northern part of the city has fallen victim to nectoplasmic assaults. Perhaps it would be wise for you to hurry on over there and be illuminated with your purifying light. Oh, I don't know how long it's going to take to get through the shopping mall. I mean, I can try, but... I don't know. I'll have to think about it. What you got to say to me? The mall is full of specters. It's terribly frightening. Very, very frightening me. Hey, if it ain't my good old buddy Zachary. <laughs> Buenos dias, DRM. Where's a better place to shop than a shopping mall? Okay. Fortune ticket. Well, too bad. Masashi bat. Emmanuel bat. Uh, I'm assuming Emmanuel would give me more strength than the Masashi bat. Battle. Oh, loyal symbol. Ah! I keep messing up. I just bought a bunch of loyal symbols. Crap. That's why I keep having it hit up instead of left or right. Yeah, I think I can sell the old stuff. Because as you can see, you don't get a whole lot of money back for selling some of this stuff. But that's all I'm selling. Mm, I think I'd have enough time to do the shopping mall stuff. At least I hope, because I don't remember how much... Oh boy, I think all I gotta do here is wander the maze. This is by far the worst part of this one because you gotta go through a maze. Our plastic chairs are specially designed without any dangerous edges. I sense a theme here that every that everyone here is a hypochondriac. As you can as you might have seen down that corner there, it kind of loops. The freshest air comes from our bottles of smoke. I'm not quite sure why you'd, why you'd be smoke. Build your walls out of metal. In the event of an attack, their solid solidity is ensured. Oh, hello. I managed to find a, find a way out of this maze. Unfortunately, we're right back in one. It's a mannequin. The Gomez Galleries offer you a large variety of boxes full of plastic and metal. 
Feeling morose? Take a trip to the park. Well, apparently there's no way to get to the park right now, so... Gomez luck tickets are manufactured and special tested by specialists. Oh, I didn't know people actually made those things. Depressed. Try Modestia. Modestia is now meant- oh. Oh, I see a rat-looking thing. It's a rodent of unusual size. Specifically, it's a Masu. Ghoul of a Fulminant Chakra. Okay, this may be a bit because I never- Oh, wait. Maybe I'm wrong. Nope, wait, I've been through here already. Crap. One moment. Gotta figure out my way through this maze. Wonder how long this episode's gonna go. Oh, here's a way. What's this? Oh, it's a Nelson. I'm lost. I could make a fire with the boxes to ward off the ghosts, but that would be too dangerous. Yeah, I gotta agree with you on that one, because starting a fire with no way of getting out of there, well, yeah, that does sound pretty dangerous. Okay, I think I'm on the right track, because there's a, there was a hallway right there. So let's go this way. Yep, I think I found my way out. Hey, it's Cat! Which one are you? Is the is not this publicity so effective and efficient whilst defying the basics of consumer marketing? For silkier hair, the meat mountains of Alma. That makes no sense. Oh, you can read? Anyway, I am glad to have found you. Maybe you can help me unravel the mystery that fate has placed before me. It turns out that my brother has been living in this area for many years. He has a special affinity for colors of the cool kind. Is hot pink a cool color? I don't know, that, that seems more like a warm color to me. Unfortunately, I have so far failed to cross his path. I have tried to betake myself to the roof of the library where he resides. However, I found the door closed. Even the long hours of intensive, repeated meowing and compulsive scratching did not do a thing. My request is as follows. If at the bend of a corridor you happen to see Valerie, give him my greetings. Okay. What exquisite composition. What subtlety and form. This truly this is truly a masterpiece. A work that will be remembered. Hmm. I will not question your tastes in art. Okay. Make sure you hit that, by the way, because I remember last time I played this game, I went all the way back through the maze not knowing what to do until I saw that and went, Oh, I was supposed to call it Pedalo. Also, I find it funny that when I say, Ugh, I hate mazes, I suck at navigating mazes, I wind up getting through that one with relatively no issue. But I think I am all out of time for this episode, so thank you so much for watching. Next time, I'm going to see just where that Pedalo takes me. I think I got a good idea where, but we'll see. Anyway, I hope you have a good morning, day, night, wherever you are, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.